Once again, ladies and gentlemen, this is the moment we've all been waiting for. Two of America's best Muay Thai fighters making their way to the ring. And here we see Chike, Vicious, Croc, Lindsay out of Bangkok Boxing in Atlanta. And can't wait to see this fight, Phoenix. You said it yourself, Vicious Croc should be called the Punisher as well. Yeah, I, the guy's got blinding speed. I mean, every time he kicks the pads and you see him, like, strike something, it's, it's got such a sting, such a thud. He's an incredible fighter and an incredible athlete. He's a very good fighter. He's coming off wins off fighters such as Malapet. He's fought face guys like Kaz Mulkey and Peter Ben. He fought Kevin Ross. He's fought in some of the best names. And, uh, you know, can't wait to see this fight. And coming out right now, also, Cyrus Washington. Both fighters are going to prepare for the Y crew. Once again, Chike Lindsay coming out of Bangkok Boxing in Atlanta under Crew Ku Ton. And Cyrus Washington out of Militia Fight Academy. Now, Cyrus Washington has trained in Thailand many times, has lived in Thailand. Fought in Thailand, trained out of Tiger Muay Thai. Very experienced, has fought the likes of Kao Kalai, Kai Hollenbeck, Nikki Holtzkin, some of the best guys in the game. And many, many, many more. Actually, Cyrus Washington has, was a bare knuckle fighting champion in Burma. Get out of here. Yep. I didn't know that. Something like that. Something, I think it was Burma or... Burma or Cambodia or one of those things, a bare knuckle boxing champion. Wow. Yep. I spoke to him yesterday, he didn't mention that. That's yep. cool. Yep. What's also interesting about the Y crew is uh, you know, back in the day there was no Facebook. <laughs> you know, you didn't really know uh, what camp you know the other person was fighting at and if a Y crew was similar they, they wouldn't fight because they knew that it was pretty much the same sort of like family tree. And now ladies and gentlemen for the introductions. Introducing first fighting out of the red corner representing Bangkok Boxing Atlanta Georgia and fighting with a record of 16 and 4 Ladies and gentlemen, Chike Lindsay. And uh, Washington.
construction of the industrial zone. A nice street fight, obey my commands at all times. In case of a knockdown, go to the neutral point I tell you to go to, the main hand tie, call you out. Any questions over here? Any questions over here? Don't you try fair, fight hard, touch them up. All right, Phoenix, we are ready for the fight that we've all been waiting for. Chike Lindsay versus Cyrus Washington. Ah, I just I can't say enough about it. It's going to be one exciting fight. Cyrus Washington, a very, very explosive and fight, uh, you know, very exciting fighter. Chike Lindsay as well. Chike Lindsay, I would say the more technical of the two, Cyrus Washington, the more unorthodox, but also very explosive. Yeah, he's very creative. You know, he, he's been known to do some pretty exciting stuff like spinning back kicks and jumping knees. Both of these guys come from a traditional Muay Thai background, so both of these guys are going to take, you know, they're going to take the first round to kind of size each other up, score some, some most of what you're going to see, you're going to score some, probably some body kicks, some inside leg kicks. Kind of measure their distance, figure out the weaknesses of, of one another, and then start getting to work. Now this fight is a Yakao uh, extreme elimination fight. The winner of this fight moves on to compete in Italy in the January two, 2013 card. Yeah, January 2013, both one of these fighters, the winner of this fight, will compete Ooh. at Yokao Extreme in Milan, Italy, which is going to be headlined by an incredible bout, which is Andy Sauer versus John Oscar. So both of these guys are going to be mixing it up with some of the top guys in the world. Stream. Good exchanges by both fighters. Fighters matching up, neutralizing. It's a stalemate, so they were separated. Cyrus Washington with a head kick that was blocked by Chike. Chike Lindsay's recent win was on uh, Malapet Sasi Prapa, a very well known yeah. legend in the sport of Muay Thai. And, and, uh, Chike Lindsay you know, picked him apart. And unanimously defeated him. Uh, also, one thing I failed to mention: uh, our earlier fighter that just won the co-main event, Eddie Martinez, also fought Chike Lindsay. Oh yeah, and, and uh, Chike won by uh, by, by a knockout, knockout with an elbow. Yeah. yeah. So Chike Lindsay, very experienced, has fought some very tough guys, and uh, you know he's fighting another tough guy tonight. Cyrus Washington, no stranger to facing some of the best guys in the world. Both guys know what they're doing in the clinch. You can see as they slip their arm inside and outside, both jockeying for the the uh, position. Nice knee there, powerful knee there by Chike. Chike gave for hand there in the clinch, trying to sneak his hands in to get the full clinch. Cyrus Washington doing a good job of not letting him. Yeah. Cyrus Washington. I always really stress to fighters how important it is to know the clinch. You know, if you don't know the clinch and you do Muay Thai, it's like trying to do MMA and not know Jiu Jitsu. Oh, yeah. One of my favorite things when, when I was fighting or when I fight is I love the clinch. I love it very much. It's, it's one of my favorite, favorite parts of the Muay Thai game. Oh, oh big hook big there. Big hook. Big hook, but it just glanced Cyrus. Good round by both guys. Yeah. Uh, like I said, they're going to take it a lot easier in the first round. This is not nothing yet of what they're capable of. Yeah. Expect to see more action in round two. Kind of feeling each other out, seeing where each other's strengths are, where each other's power, you know, it lies. They are professional fighters. I was talking to Cyrus Washington um, yesterday, you know, we were talking about his, his loss with uh, Kai Hollenbeck, which is a great fight. Hollenbeck uh, is an impressive fighter as well. And you know, I said, well, how did you feel about the loss? Because, you know, I fight, so you can't think too much about it, and then you can't take it for granted either. You learn from it, and then you keep moving forward, you keep moving forward. I'm going to see what uh, Ricardo Perez is telling me. And Ricardo Perez, the last thing he said was to pick it up. He wants him to pick up the pace in round two, which is only natural as the fight goes on. And here we're going to get off to start to round two. Nice body kick there by Cyrus Washington and Chica Lindsay in response with one of his own. A double jab there by Chica. Nice outside leg kick there by Cyrus Washington. Oh, oh nice. And a glancing head kick there. 
Cyrus Washington said that his game plan was for every one shot he took to answer back with two. Nice quick hook and cross by, si uh, by Chike Lindsay. Spinning, spinning back, back, kick. back kick. Cyrus Washington is known to throw different spinning kicks here and there. Cyrus Washington has a background in other martial arts as well. Yeah, he has background in Taekwondo. He says he loves using it. He mm -hmm. loves the styles in Taekwondo. Some kicks in there, so he'll see him throw those spinning kicks yeah, often. Yeah, spinning back kicks and hook kicks. Deep kick there to the thigh by Chike Lindsay, answered with a head kick by Cyrus Washington that's blocked. Deep kick there by Chike Lindsay. Coming in with a hook. is setting something up with uh, using his back leg front kick. There's something he's setting up. Trying to sneak in that uppercut with the lead hand. Oh, nice body kick that moves, Cyrus. Now in Thailand, though, any kick that moves your body and makes you move and is, scores. Uh, scores very yeah. highly. And it shows that you have power. Good there, mate. Both fighters being very technical, scoring. Chike putting his hand in, in Cyrus Washington's face to score with that knee. Oh, a nice body kick by Chike as well. Nice body kick again by Chike. Block by Chike. Nice deep kick there by Chike. She could definitely be naturally larger of the two fighters. Yeah, super strong. But uh, Cyrus Washington has used that, using that speed as well. Is so far very evenly matched. Both guys scoring well. Oh, nice cross, nice body kick, followed up by a cross. Momentary groin shot there, but. Cyrus Washington's fine to continue. Ten seconds left in this round. Let's see if these guys are going to get off to any other any other techniques. And nope, we'll go to the end of round two. So, ladies and gentlemen, prepare for rounds three through five. Are definitely the ones that are going to be the most action-packed. Both of these guys come from traditional Thai backgrounds, so they are going to take those first two rounds, which is pretty much customary. Pretty much customary in Muay Thai, both fighters are going to take those first two rounds to kind of size each other up. But you see that the speed is starting to increase, and expect three and four, as you see that glancing head kick in the instant replay. Almost caught Cyrus. And then another quick, quick lead up uh, hook. A nice knee there by Chike Lindsay. Body kick followed by a cross. Chika Lindsay definitely picking up the pace in this round. And we will see. You will see the pace definitely increase in round three through five as both fighters start to really unleash their best weapons. And here we get started to round number three. see the intention on both guys a little bit harder a little bit stronger each time Chica is setting things up oh big body kick nice snap sound echoing through the arena we haven't seen Chica we didn't see Chica lose too much of the uh, lead leg now he's finally starting to pick it up and go towards the head of Cyrus nice teeth there by Chica oh oh nice slip and a kick there Nice, low kick, quick hook and then a low kick by Chike. Good movement by Cyrus Washington there. Inside leg kick by Chike. So far, Chike is stalking Cyrus Washington down. Yeah. He's got the larger frame. Deep kick again. His teeth kick's been working for Chike this evening. Yes. That's 
one too, vicious one too, that if he lands it, it's going to be very, very devastating. Yeah. So far, he hasn't landed it yet. Well, Cyrus Washington does a good job of keeping his hands up. Yeah. Side leg kick. Nice counter. Both guys still sizing each other up. They know each other. They know that one another is very dangerous. Yeah, um, Cyrus was telling me he's well, well acquainted with Chike because he's, he's fought one of his teammates. Oh, big hook. Goes for a head kick, but Cyrus Washington able to slip out of there. Ooh, big one, two. Chike keeps it back with the jab. These guys both have vicious power. Anything can happen at any moment, so both guys are making sure to keep their guards up. Eric, I know that the Prashad is usually worn on the left side, but what does it mean if a fighter has two? <laughs> hey, normally, I mean, you see some guys fighters, yeah, they're always wearing on the left, and some guys usually wear it on the left. Oh, nice uh, body kick. Oh, and he goes for a spinning hook kick there, but he didn't land it. I think Chike might have blocked it. Yeah, Chike uh, blocked it or tried to teep and it just ended up uh, throwing Cyrus off balance. Well, one thing you do to block one of those spinning kicks is you step into it or yeah. you kick out the, that back leg. Yeah, yeah. But he stepped in. Chike stepped in. Or, or to the side? Yeah. Well, I think what he was trying, I mean, he just... Oh, he, he was, was, he was throwing he was a teep in general? Yeah. Uh, well, that worked. <laughs> yeah, so it worked. Throw him off balance. Nice low kick there by Cyra, I mean, by Chike Lindsay. I'd like to see Chike. His cheek is landing with those, those low kicks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's the end of round three. Like I said, Chike's landing with those low kicks, but he's not throwing them a lot. You know, he's, he's landed every single one of them. Every time he throws that nice lead hook and then goes, cuts low. But he hasn't been throwing it too much, and I think if he starts using it more, he can definitely cause some damage. Yeah, we'll see what happens in this round, too, because he may be setting something up with that as well. Tie in Chicago, cornering Cyrus Washington here. Kun Pon, who Kun Pon out of Bangkok boxing, which is Chike Lindsay. We are heading into the fourth round. And our fourth round gets underway. See both guys still measuring. They know that each other, each person, each one has power. Ooh, oh, nice, nice, nice quick hook, hook by uh, Chike. Quick lead left hook there by Chike. He's changing his angles with his punches a lot, you know, a lot, which I like. He'll throw a hook and then with the same hand, he'll follow with a jab. Oh, with a big cook, big kick to the head there by, by Chike. But Cyrus Washington able to slip right out. Grabs, oh, nice. grabs the kick. Grabs the kick, lands two knees. Nice jab to the body, teeth to the body. check there goes for the low kick Cyrus Washington and Chike checks but as he checks it slices up a gash on his shin Ooh, nice knee to the midsection there deep by Chike Chike likes throwing those small little teeps to them thigh oh, oh nice. beautiful slip and in return body kick Chike likes to throw those little keeps to the thigh to consistently keep Cyrus Washington guessing. Oh, beautiful combination. combination there. Quick jab, lead hook, cross, and then a body kick. Definitely think Chike can open up a little bit more with those hands and cause some damage. Being a little shy with throwing those punches, but he's very quick with them. Slip there, slip and a counter. Oh, nice. nice jab and, a ca and another body kick. Inside leg kick there by Cyrus Washington. So far, very, very technical fight by both of these guys. But Chike opening up definitely has power in his hands. This guy's like, 
every shot he throws, he he's so strong. One double jab and then a quick hook. Cyrus Washington tries to move in. Chike definitely the one who's pushing the pace right now. Nice, nice catch and then knee and drives Cyrus to the ground. Yeah, Chike's just doing more of the stalking and, and landing more shots. Yeah, Chike's definitely picking up the pace now. Has that hook, lead hook there to the head. Nice head movement by Cyrus Washington there. You can see the determination in Chike's eyes. He definitely has, I would say, has found his range, has found his rhythm. Yeah. He's looking very determined. He's not wasting any shots. He's just trying to find what works for him. Oh, big, big body, body shot. shot. Nice hook. Cyrus Washington coming forward now. And that is the end of round number four. So far, Phoenix, I think uh, Cyrus is, I mean, sorry, Chike has taken the last two. Um, I think he's, he's starting to find his rhythm, he's finding yeah. his pace, scoring with the bigger shots. Yeah. And, um, you know, we're going to have to see what, what goes on in, in round five. But he's, I mean, I can tell you, he can let those hands go, and he's got very powerful hands. Like, yeah. Really hurts him. This is the fifth and final round of what has been an exciting event so far, Muay Thai at the Mecca 2. What have you thought about it, Venus? I've seen some really impressive fights so far. I, I mean, I think, you know, there was a good display of Thai boxing technique, catching kicks, uh, sweeps to the ground. That's great use of the clinch. Check out the replay from the fourth round of our Cyrus Washington Chike Lindsay bout. You see there, big body kick by Chike. Those combinations, that quick jab and then body kick again. And this is the fifth and final round. This is the one where they take home, take home the bacon. It's going to take home the final, final, you know, opportunity to fight at Yokal Boxing's Yokal Extreme event, January 2013. Let's see who wants it more. I think part of the thing uh, here with Cyrus Washington is he's having a hard time uh, getting in or figuring out what to do with Chike. Yeah, Chike is, oh, oh, there he goes, oh. very nice combination. Talk about that. And, oh, and Cyrus yeah. Washington getting to work right now very quickly. Low kick, then the body kick. Chike Lindsay answering. Yeah, right there back. you go, that hook kick landed. Nice body kick there by Chike. Inside leg kick blocked. Outside body kick blocked. Chike slips slip that lead there. kick. Fires back with the body kick. Chike definitely finding his rhythm. Double pump jab. This is my favorite part kick. of the fifth round Thai music. Yeah. The drum banging just consistently speeding up the pace of the fighters. You can see Chike throws that lead body kick. Oh, oh and a nice shot. Cyrus, kind yeah, of just Cyrus got caught okay. by that. Both fighters definitely pushing the pace in this round. Lead uppercut cross by by Chike. Crosses the body by Chike. Fired back with a gets countered with a low kick. Beautiful slips there by Chike. Cyrus Washington fakes to the body and comes up to the head. Blocked. I mean, uh, Chike did that. Cyrus blocks it. Oh, and a nice head kick blocked by, Chike, uh, by Cyrus Washington. Nice Goes for the back leg. Kick. Ooh, some spit glue there. <laughs> yeah. Big knee big by, knee. ooh, big knees big by knee. Chike. Big knee by Chike again. Chike getting to work in the clinch. Gets, dominant clinch there. Got a dominant clinch. Then latch, lines up again using his shoulder. 30 seconds left. Beautiful knees on the inside by both guys. 30 seconds left in this, in this round. In this fifth and final round. Technical fight by both guys with Chike definitely using his teeps to. Oh, and a nice flip kick to the head, fakes to the body, then goes Not to the head. Big knee. 
big knees to the midsection. Chike really getting to work here in the last few seconds. And that is the end of our main event here at Muay Thai at the Mecca 2. Coming live to you from Madison Square Garden in New York City. And a uh, beautiful fight by both of these guys. I think Chike uh, kind of pulled away in those last three rounds, Phoenix. Yeah, I would say so, too. What I, I, what I think it was was um, I think uh, Cyrus has an idea of how strong and how powerful Chike is. And sometimes going in with a guy like that is really risky. He didn't feel an opportunity to counter, so, you know. Yeah, Chike very quick, very, very quick. Powerful too. I mean, he needs to be bigger and stronger of these two than I. Big knees on the inside there, my Chike. I love those type of kicks. Me too. Yeah, big to the midsection and go to the head. And if you have speed, you can pull yeah, them off. You can always pull them off. Cyrus did have his hands up for a lot of those head kicks, man. Because he did. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the main event, as a result of judges unanimous decision now the red corner Chikay Lindsay <laughs> ladies and gentlemen we'd like to thank you once again for joining us at Madison Square Garden Theater for Muay Thai at the Mecca 2 Remember, the official after party is at Villa Paki in the Meatpacking District, 55 Gansevoort Street. It'll be.